Spring break has been mostly quiet this year with laws and rules in place on Panhandle beaches. In South Walton County, a curfew was designed to keep teens and college students from overtaking the area at night. But that curfew caused a bit of its own problem just a few days ago. As News 13's Jake Holter tells us, videos of large crowds of kids have gone viral. This video shows massive crowds of kids flooding the streets of Seaside Thursday night. Those under 21 are subject to an 8 p.m. curfew during spring break unless accompanied by a parent. As you might suspect, most of the kids we spoke with don't like the rule. I hate the 8 p.m. curfew. I think it needs to be pushed back. Definitely. Um, it's, it's almost still sunny outside at 8. <laughs> um, and I just think that we need to have more time to go play on the beach. I like watching the sunset and riding around with my friends. Some even think the curfew spurs the rowdiness at night. I feel like a lot of that is the curfew. You know, it's like that makes people want to rebel more if you can't be out. You know, it makes people want to be out more. But Seaside officials say despite the size and rowdiness of the crowds, there have not been any serious incidents. We know what's happening at night. We're, we're here uh, while it's happening. We're here first thing in the morning before anyone else is, is on property. We see the lack of destruction. We see the containment that's being uh, put forth by the sheriff's office and our security team here on site. Walton County Sheriff's Office officials say social media has blown the situation out of proportion. I think that's just kids being kids. I mean, everybody's a kid. It's rowdy, loud, and likes to have fun. I mean, they're not doing anything bad. I don't see the problem. I think, I think part of those videos uh, goes back to a little bit of kids being kids. Um, but I think there's always going to be a cycle with spring break. We're going to talk about how some years are good and some years are bad. Some weeks are worse than others. In Seaside, Jay Coulter, News 13, Panhandle Strong. Walton County Sheriff's Office officials will be posting an update from Seaside tonight on their social media pages.